Hello friends, in this video, we'll learn how to make the process from dispatch to delivery easy and smooth and how to maintain strong communication with your parties. We are discussing the delivery management feature of Mark ERP, which helps you generate delivery reports for multiple parties at once and easily provide delivery details through WhatsApp and SMS. This way, your parties can click the preview link in the delivery message to view complete information about the products that they are receiving and make payments through any online payment mode. First, to activate the delivery management feature, go to the home screen. Then masters and under password and power, go to operators. Select the user and search for delivery in the search bar. Click accept to go to the setup. Here, you'll see the first option, delivery management. Set it to 0 for not allowed, 1 for view only and 2 for edit. If you select 1, you can only view the products being delivered to your parties without dispatching them. To view and dispatch orders, select option 2. Setting it to 0 means you don't want to use this option. Let's select option 2 so we can view and dispatch party orders. Press the escape key to save changes and the delivery management feature is now activated. Now, from the transaction menu, select delivery management. There are two options, delivery and report. You can dispatch party bills through the delivery option or check dispatched bills through the report option. Let's select the delivery option. You will see the complete delivery panel here. You can select a specific party whose bills you want to dispatch. Then, select the date range for the bills you want to view and dispatch. You can also manage delivery by area, route, station or MRYs parties. For example, if a consignment is going to the Azadpur route, you can select the area and route accordingly. If you want to see all bills, skip these fields and simply click Show to display the party bills. Here, you can also filter to view pending, delivered, under process or all bills. Additionally, you can search for specific bills by customer name or item name using the provided search box. You will see how many bills are delivered, pending or in processing and you can check the status of bills by clicking on status. If any bill contains cold storage items, a tick will be displayed. You can print these bills and with the refresh button, new bills will load into the list. If you are using the dispatch management feature, you will see a tick next to completed stages. If you want to dispatch only bills where all stages are completed, go to the home screen, then masters and in the mark setup control room, search for delivery and set it to 1 after dispatch. If you are not using dispatch management, keep it set to 0 and return to the home screen by pressing escape key and go to delivery management to select the date range and show the bills. Tick the bills you want to dispatch and simply click the dispatch button. You will see a pop-up window for delivery details. Here, select the delivery man you want to send the parcels with. You can also enter vehicle number, number of packets or parcels and number of cartons. You can skip these fields if you prefer. Next is the dispatch date, which defaults to the current date. But you can select the date you want to dispatch the bills. Click the submit button and another pop-up will confirm the bills. Click OK to proceed. After dispatching orders, press the escape button to return to the home screen. Go to transactions, then delivery management and select report. Choose the date range and click the show button to display details of dispatched bills. From here, you can edit the reports, print them in PDF or Excel format or view them. You can also send the dispatch bill details directly to the party via WhatsApp by clicking send in the WhatsApp column and submit the bills for delivery through the e-delivery app. If you want to edit the delivery sheet, click the edit button and alert window will show up. If you want to open it in select mode, click yes for manual, click no. We'll click yes for select mode. You can add new bills by clicking add, edit bill details or remove bills. Finally, click finalize to save your changes. And after finalizing the report, you cannot make any changes. If you want to watch the detailed video on sending via WhatsApp, click the link in the description. Now that we have learned how to dispatch bill in select mode, let's see how to dispatch them in manual mode. 
First, map the areas to the routes. For example, in Route 1, New Delhi, Azadpur and Pitampura come under this route. Map multiple routes with their respective areas and save this as a one-time process. Next, go to the select slot and mention the slot numbers. For instance, if bills are dispatched to two times a day, you will mention two slot numbers accordingly. Now, choose the route where you want to dispatch the bills and the areas where products are being delivered. Enter the vehicle number, delivery man and delivery type. You can scan the invoice or enter the manual invoice number. Then, click the Get Invoice button to display the particular bill. Then, mention the number of bags and cartons and click Done. And you can also add multiple bills one by one. Now, click Manual Dispatch to dispatch the bills. And an alert message will confirm that the bills have been successfully submitted. Here, you can also check reports and fill in the delivery date. Select route, select slot, delivery man, driver man and unique number. Then click process, clicking on cash or credit GUI. You can view dispatch bill details. You can also view reports in various formats. If you want to change, remove or add anything to dispatched bills, go back to the report panel from the home screen. Click edit and an alert window will appear. Click yes for select mode or no for manual mode to change bill details. So from here, you will update the details by changing them. So in this video, we have learned about the delivery management feature in Mark ERP. Thanks for watching.